I do accept Frank's marriage proposal. There's just a lot of things that fall into place in, in Natalia's way of thinking that just kind of makes sense to her. And, you know, she's got this person that she loves basically nudging her along. And it kind of just, it's very black and white in her brain as far as, yeah, I have to say yes. This is the right thing to do. And we talk about it and both say this is the right thing to do. It's probably also but it's, a way for both of them to find right. a safer place to. Right I think because it's getting, because it's getting, it's getting to it's a place where it's on, they don't know what to do about well, it, things right? Are, things are coming out. Yeah. Things are emerging, and, and they're trying. They're, they don't know what to do, so they're sort of trying to put everything back in its place, at least according to how they were living. And I love the fact that you guys got Doris. I love how you got her back with. I was waiting to, from the last. That was fun. I really like that. To set, will you set that up a little bit for the people that'll see this? Um. Well, uh, Olivia, kind of. <laughs> well, Olivia is out and about. She's, you know, just taking a stroll and and ends up uh, looking to have a drink. She does that often. It's not a. It's not. Well, what's with that? <laughs> It's just like one drink. She doesn't get like wasted all the time. She goes, yeah, that's bad. But anyway, so she goes to have a drink. She stumbles on ladies' night, blah, blah, blah. Um, turns out ladies' night is really just solely for ladies. She doesn't really. And then she, you know, kind of realizes where she's at and takes it all in. And there's Doris wearing a hat. It's very important that she's wearing a hat. The hat's a big disguise. Did not recognize her with that fedora on. Yeah, so then the, you, the two characters kind of have a little confrontation of, what are you doing? Why are you hiding? Why are you hiding? That kind of thing. Um, I'm oversimplifying or no? That's fine. No, yeah. No. Um, and so now there's kind of a shared secret among the three of them because Olivia tells Natalia. And we obviously want the court date moved up, so we, right. we uh, you know, decide to, I think, I think. Is it a blackmail? I think it's a false, um, false act because I end up saying to Doris later on I never would have done it yeah, but it, it was it was a bluff it was Doris had said to her what do you want to keep quiet and we thought well let's get this trial date moved up to protect Emma because we're not sure where Philip's head is it's not a whole lot to ask it's um, not like you and know. so we just said you know you might want to think about doing that and Doris gets the the gist point. of it yeah. and yeah but it's it's sort of goes nowhere and in fact I think Doris ends up becoming more of a, a confidant for Olivia